Hey, what's up, YouTube? Spawn here. So this is gonna be like a little bit of a news video thing. So yesterday, Konami uh, came out, or not yesterday, on the third rather. Um, they came out with a blog post, a belated holiday gift to all duelists. And if you read down in the article, they say, go on to say here, that they basically got this idea to make the perfect idea. So. A belated holiday gift to all of us. The effects text for one of the strongest monsters will release all year. If you wish to remain spoiler free, turn back now. But, it's blank. <laughs> and... So, essentially, they were like, here's the effect. It's blank. And then they made a follow-up post the next day. And... It was in response to all the article, and these are a bunch of questions that people asked, and Konami goes on and answers them. They're like, have you lost your mind? No. Is this a joke? No. Are you trolling us? No. Are you sure there's no image there? There's no image. It's blank. Uh, is this a card creation contest? No. Uh, <laughs> is, the, is the card the friends we made along the way, or our own imagination or some sort of motivational poster material and they're like no it's a real card in raging tempest so we know when this card will be released it is raging tempest and it is not a card that already exists we know that too so that means it has to be a tcg exclusive in raging tempest uh, is this a political statement no why can't i find this card on the internet doesn't exist yet <laughs> uh so really what does this monster do this is another big highlight point that i wanted to point out Nothing as indicated by its effect text being a blank space with nothing in it. So they basically, uh, if I'm translating this correctly, they basically just told us that this is a vanilla. Uh, and they're like, do you really expect us to believe that a monster that does nothing can be one of the strongest monsters of 2017? They go ahead and give the example of Metal Foes, which are a very big deck right now in the meta. And then when can we see this card? January 24th will be when they release the effect text of this card. So, two things I think we can safely assume from this. One, it's a vanilla. Two, it's a pendulum. Um, the fact that we know it does something, but the effect text of it is blank means it's a vanilla pendulum. So, basically the rest they purely left up, left up for us to just think about and create cool ideas for. So, I'm going to go ahead and give a couple pieces of speculation. Um... The first thing that I think is, I, I think it's guaranteed to be a vanilla pendulum. I think that's all but confirmed. Uh, I, I think one thing that I might do is, since it's supposed to be one of the strongest monsters of 2017, maybe it's like uh, a one card scale in the form of where it's like, it's one card in your pendulum zone, but it counts as two scales. So like on pendulum cards, like you have like uh, the two arrows on them. On one side, it's like maybe like 13, the other it's zero. So every deck can play this card in pendulum summon. Uh, I think it's also going to be a level 4, so I think that's probably my best guess, is like a level 4 generic vanilla pendulum. So, that has some crazy pendulum effect, like like I said, being like a one card scale, so it's like one card treated as two scales, different scales. Or uh, maybe it's something like the one card pendulum, it's a, a pendulum, and uh, you place it in your pendulum scale, and all of your monsters become unaffected by card effects. Um, and like the card itself can't be destroyed by card effects. Um, uh, the other thing I thought about was, well, if it's just, like, an 8,000 vanilla beat stick level 4, so you just summon it and it's a one-punch kill, and they'd have to name it One Punch Man, that's absolutely not debatable. Um, but yeah, uh, really, other than that, guys, it's really just up to speculation, really. This is all the information we really have about the card right now. So, um, yeah, I'll leave the links to these articles down in the description below. I know I'm like a day late on this, but I don't really do news videos that often, so I really just do the ones that I think are really interesting. And I thought this was something very unique, so I decided to cover it. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think this card might be down in the comment section below. Do you agree with any of my speculations? Do you think there might be something else that it might be? I'd be interested to hear you guys' thoughts on this. So uh, yeah, uh, follow me on Twitter. Link will be down in the description below. And thanks for watching, guys. Comment, rate, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys later. Spawny out.